been two weeks now since an L.A. firefighter disappeared after a trip to Mexico, and the case has even caught the attention of L.A. Mayor Eric Garcetti, but the family has not heard of any developments. KCAL 9's Rachel Kim spoke with the missing firefighter's daughter. He's never gone more than a day without contacting and making sure that he's okay to his family. But it's been two weeks since Bella Aguilar and her family have seen her father, 48-year-old Frank Aguilar. On August 20th, the 20-year veteran of the Los Angeles Fire Department went to his condo near Rosarito, Mexico. And as always, when Aguilar got there, he texted them a picture of the beach. That was the last communication from him. The next day, his brother and cousin went to check on him. And they had found, um, like, things moved around in his condo. Drawers are open, picture frames were moved. It was kind of a scene like people were looking for something. Um, then they discovered that two vehicles are missing, a laptop and a few more items. There was also no sign of Aguilar. That's when his family contacted authorities in Mexico. Since then, Bella tells us investigators there and the FBI have been trying to find out what happened to Aguilar. She said they heard about possible foul play from media in Mexico. Then yesterday, the family was surprised to hear L.A. Mayor Eric Garcetti say her father may be a victim of a violent kidnapping. It's just like shocking because you know we associate Rosarito with the family safe vacation spot and just to hear those words come from Mayor Garcetti was was just very surreal. Mayor Garcetti said the city is working to make sure the 48 year old is safely returned home. Bella tells us her family is thankful for those who are trying to find her father but they would like to know exactly what's being done and what investigators know so far. Well, we haven't received any calls or ransoms yet. We're all just sitting and making calls as much as we can but we're not receiving information. We're getting asked questions, but we're not receiving answers. That's our frustration right now. Bella says the family doesn't know who or why anyone would want to harm her father. She said Aguilar is well known and well loved here and in Rosarito, where generations of her family have called home. But right now we're just trying everything we can to get him back. We have our ups and downs. We don't know what to expect right now. It's just completely on edge. Authorities in Mexico are leading this investigation. The FBI says they're assisting and providing resources to them. If you have any information about Aguilar's whereabouts, please contact the FBI or your local authorities. Rachel Kim, KCAL 9 News.